And now, Excellencies, distinguished guests, Excellence. we will hear the first of three musical interludes of songs originally created for past commemoration ceremonies. Today, those will be performed by a new generation of artists as a symbol of intergenerational transmission for the preservation of memory. I would now like to invite Kenny Mirasano and Christian Wukuru to perform a medley of the songs Iwuka, originally sung by Suzanne Niranyamibka and never again sung by Masamba Inori. Remain standing for the moment of silence. You may be seated. Nyakuwaha President Republika na Madamu, Wanyachiwe Romutera Nihano, Wachitsi Vahire, Chutizu Rwanda, Wanyar Rwanda, Wanyar Rwanda Kazi. Mudukuri Chiekuri Radio, Televizio, Nukumbuga Nkona Yemanyi Mbaga, Nwara Mutse. Nituwa Mukura Rinda Alain Bernard, Hamadou Mvujizi, Wunjirije, Wa Gouvernoma. Nyakuwaha President. Monsieur le Président. Mr. President, 
You are Excellency Salilidis and gentlemen, we are now commemorating for the 30th time uh, the genocide against the Tutsi. We are gathered here representing the international community and remembering that uh, that uh, uh, genocide uh, killed more than a million people. Call observed. My name is Sandrine Omotone. I am the Minister of State for Youth and Arts. We are honored to welcome you all, Rwandans and friends of Rwanda, present here at home across our country and all over the world on this solemn day of a 30th commemoration, as we remember more than one million men, women, and children slain during the 100 days of the genocide against the Tutsi in 1994. We now invite you to turn your attention to the illuminated tree. The tree's branches and foliage represent the protection that targeted families could not find during the genocide and that Rwandans today can count on. The upright trunk echoes the aspirations of the young generation, reinforced by the internal light and flowing sap of life within. The roots illustrate the memory of the past that we must preserve, our shared Rwandan culture on which we are all anchored and from which we draw inspiration and strength to reach for the sky as we build a brighter future. 